Forget every other rumor about the Galaxy S25. Because when it comes to Samsung's upcoming flagship, there's one thing that will be a total game changer. Or a deal breaker. What is it? It's all about the silicon. We've heard the leaks earlier in this video attached here, you can watch it after this to compare. Also, we have seen the renders and have a pretty good idea of the Galaxy S25's display and colors. But the real story here is what's under the hood. Qualcomm Snapdragon 8 Elite, a new powerhouse chipset set to give Samsung's next flagship some serious edge. But here's the twist. It might not be on every model. Just because Qualcomm announced the Snapdragon 8 Elite doesn't guarantee every Galaxy S25 will get it. Some models might run it and others might not. But if it's included, let's just say it'll put Samsung in a prime position to rival the iPhone 16 and Pixel 9. Now, the Snapdragon 8 Elite is on a reference device. In benchmark tests, this thing just ripped through the numbers. We're talking a 40% performance boost over the Galaxy S24 Ultra's Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 in single-core processing and a 42% leap in multi-core. But here's the kicker. It's even competing neck and neck with Apple's A18 chip from the iPhone 16 Pro. That's no small feat. And in graphics testing, it goes beyond even what Apple has done, making it potentially the fastest mobile chipset around right now. But raw speed isn't everything. Qualcomm has managed to boost power efficiency by 44% for the CPU and 40% for the GPU, meaning that while it's faster, it's also consuming less power. What does that mean? For Galaxy S25, this could translate to even better battery life than the S24 Ultra, which already made our best battery life list. To be honest, I don't like to tell people to subscribe, but let us do it to enhance this channel to grow you are the one to make me the real tech guru. It took me a couple of hours to create this fancy image in my description to impress you guys. I love you so much. Now let us get to our business. And then there's the AI. Qualcomm has upgraded the Neural Processing Unit, or NPU, by a whopping 45%, giving Samsung plenty of potential to expand its Galaxy AI features. Imagine smoother live color adjustments, smarter voice commands, and a camera that can separate an image into over 250 layers optimizing each for the perfect shot. This level of intelligence gives Samsung's camera system a whole new edge. So when it comes to the Galaxy S25, it's clear this isn't just a small upgrade. If the Snapdragon 8 Elite becomes the standard in every S25 model, we're looking at a phone that's faster, smarter, and lasts longer than any Samsung we've seen yet. But what do you think? Will this new Snapdragon chip make the Galaxy S25 an iPhone killer? Or is it just another piece of silicon? Let me know in the comments and don't forget to hit that like button if you're as hyped as I am about the Galaxy S25. We love you.